You're welcome. Thank you. I believe my friends are waiting for me, Jojo and Shay. Yes. So let's get you checked up. Awesome. Hi. Oh, thank you. Press spots and then we'll show you where your locker is. Okay. I haven't really been out the house. I haven't spoken to anyone about my breakup with MJ. I've been laying low and trying to get my thoughts together. Honestly, it's been a lot. Oh, hi. Hola. Me and Jojo and Shay have had this spa day planned out for ages. But now I feel like I wish I could just vent about MJ without having his sister here. Lord knows I needed this day and it's just, it's been a lot going on lately, so. So bitch, get to talking. Mm -hmm. Well, what do y'all got going on? Long story short, the other day I went to have lunch with Prima Donna, but she never mentioned that she had invited somebody else. MJ's ex-girlfriend. Wait, 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 yeah, wait. She invited MJ's ex and didn't even tell you? Right. She it tells me all these things about MJ and, and his past, his music, his finances and all. So after all that happened, MJ and I had a really big fight and basically broke up. And we're now like on a break. See, I've heard this story, but I heard it from oh, my okay. brother. He popped up at my house the other day. I've never seen him like this before. I've never seen him this hurt. My question to you is how is it you let this girl from 10 years ago say some to you about your current relationship and now all of a sudden her word is bond, her word is golden, this complete stranger can just come in and tell you something? When she said certain things, it just sounded too familiar to certain situations no, you're that we're dealing with. But guess what? That's your business and his business. It's not her place to continue to run her mouth about my brother to you. I don't see how that was acceptable for you not to say nothing and just sit there. You know what? Everybody's always telling me what to do with my life, what to do with my career, what to do with my friendships, what to do with my father, what to do with my mother, with everybody. I'm just over everybody telling me what the to do with my life. Everybody's all up in my business. You're like, real why? hype right I now. Like You're very, friend. very hype right now. I'm sorry, right I came to have a relaxation okay, moment. Okay, but I just asked a simple question and you getting all like, right? I just that's a lot though. I would have been like shook, if, bitch. If, if I Amada was know, dating your brother and this bitch from 10 years ago come in talking yeah, and interrupt time, their relationship, but at the same you wouldn't time, feel no type no, of way that she wanted to leave. here's the thing. First of all, I just need more. I still love him. I still care about him. But at the same time, bills and life, is, I need consistency. I think it's just really, really shallow of her to all of a sudden feel that MJ's not good enough because he doesn't have the bag. My brother never been rich and he never misrepresented who he is or who he was. So this makes no sense to me. The only way that makes sense to me is Amada's looking for a way out. He's a struggling artist and sometimes he has his high moments, he has his lows, sometimes, you know, everybody goes through their ups and downs. Okay, cool. It's a lot of stuff that my brother pushed to the side and stopped doing for you. No, I don't feel that. Yes, it's because his options were to focus on your career versus focusing on his career. And he chose to do? Yeah, yeah he chose to do okay, that. And I chose. told him he should wake he up chose. and choose to do his own and thing. I, and I have told him to wake up and do his own thing but as well. I don't know what's going on. Exactly. I don't, because you so don't tell me nothing. We're not close to it like that no Without more. having proof, you're involving yourself even more. Because of you too. How dare Shay say that it's my fault that MJ's career isn't popping? MJ is a grown ass man and he chose to focus on supporting me. Cause Your he's brother. over here trying to keep up alive. He thinks that it's so But that's bad. my relationship with him. Yeah, that has nothing to do, do with you. you. I just don't want to see my brother. I don't even know no why I'm discussing this with you. Because it's my brother and he came to me to talk okay, about that's it. Okay, that's you need to continue to talk to your brother. I will, but I'm here and I'm talking to you. Shame. Yes, Amada. I think that it is time for me to also have a break from you. That's perfectly fine. Because you do not have And to let's my just leave my things brother. as is. How There's about this? Happening How about right this? Now. Instead of a break, I bye, Jojo. Instead of a There's break, a bitch, you're cut right for now. life. I don't have time and for this because you don't I'm respect sure. loyalty. You don't respect. Oh, of friendship. course, that's loyalty. Yeah. You're all about loyalty and friendship and all that. Do what you're whatever. supposed to do. Okay. Leave my brother alone. You, you know, don't. as a matter of fact, I'll alone. do whatever the yeah. it is that I want to do with you your brother and do with him whenever the I want to. Bye, bye, bye. Right.
exactly. Yeah. Call me a bitch. Oh, I'm so scared. Whatever. What type of relaxation time is this? We just got real ghetto at a very bougie place, bitch. I don't Boy, know. Boy, I mean, how sometimes it happens in life. What's up, you guys? It's your girl Shay Johnson here. What's good? And make sure you subscribe today to Love and Hip Hop's new YouTube channel. It's new and it's live. Log on right now to stay up to date with everything that's going on.